I think it's more um, helping especially the B40 kids because I feel like they are already behind. So going to school when they are already behind, it's really tough to catch up. And encouraging reading as a quality time um, will sort of move them up a bit so that when they go to school, it's easier for them to, to, to follow the school curriculum, easier for them to move up the ladder. With the Vinod Shaker Foundation, one of the areas that he's always focused on is something called good capitalism. It's about how companies are responsible in, in terms of um, lifting up society. So we hope that this is one of the initiatives, even though it's a small way, to help the community help itself, empower um, more able children within the community to help younger children to, to read. And so it becomes a sustainable program so that YB doesn't have to go to every house to encourage because it's happening within the community itself. I'm very happy to, to uh, be with the Vinod Shekhar Foundation uh, to do this program uh, because uh, one of the things that we have been trying to do over the last couple of years, but it was stopped because of the pandemic, was to bring these books and create mini libraries in uh, people's houses, in people's homes. The idea of, of libraries is something very boring, very quiet, rarefied, and uh, it takes effort to go to. And for a lot of people, buying a book is, you know, could be a week's worth of groceries. So I find that uh, through this kind of program, we can create a circular economy of, of books and identify a certain number of families and uh, bring the books around.